Morning everyone. This is our camp that we're just leaving, just outside of uh, Kingaroy. So seven and a half Ks, it's a free camp. As we rolled into Kingaroy, with no specific plans except we were gonna find a free camp on the way to Maroochydore, Carl got chatting with one of our subscribers. They asked if we were passing through on our way to the camp oven festival. We weren't, but we are now. to go to the, what is it called? The Camp Oven, Camp Oven Festival. I'm leaving on a jet plane Don't know when I'll be back again G'day everyone. We are at the Mill Merrin Camp Oven Festival in Queensland. But we're actually here the night before. So we're hanging out for some music and I'll show you a few of the stalls that are going to be here tomorrow. Oven Festival which is in Milmerin and that is not far out of Toowoomba and it's a whole weekend where there's camp oven cooking and there's stuff. There's lots of cooking <laughs> <laughs> and eating I'm guessing too. Yeah lots of stuff to do. So, so we'll show you around, show you a few of the uh, cooking exhibitions and so on yeah. and we'll see where it takes us. A goon bag. Okay, <laughs> 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 <I> well, wish. <laughs>
Oh, that smells good. Five, four, three, two, one. And now they're in the game of the top. The Magnum Pick is started well. A couple of lights down. Shot is black pick glass here. They come through the third time up. There you put it down there. Mike Roger. They start to bunch up. You can throw a towel at all. The orange looking good out in front. A couple of lights. One back one outside. It's the uh, Eastern Lake. And blue. So I'm on this last. All this day might be stuck here. You might have to pick a good position so you can make all down. We've got the only pick out the front. They're making us behind him in the field. And it's going to stay on us last. He's starting to get the dip. Look at this orange pick, ladies and gentlemen. He's off going the way. Let's make a bit of noise here, my man. He's coming around. Why would you pick him up and let the rest of the time? He's going to make it. He's up in the ground this year. Oh, we're just going to do it again. Woo! 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 So we're now going to show you the damper throwing contest for the men. <laughs> your best protection is to keep your eye on the dampers at all times. <laughs> One's coming your way, take a vase of action because it will hurt if it hits you. <laughs> After leaving the Camp Oven Festival and just on the very outskirts of town, we noticed something strange happening just in front of us. It took us a few seconds to comprehend what was happening. There was a caravan in front of us and we thought he had just sort of pulled off and parked in the ditch. Little did we realise the caravan wasn't hooked to the vehicle. We jumped out to see whether they needed a hand and then I realised exactly what had happened. The caravan was never hooked to the vehicle and obviously the driver had made a mistake. The shackles were still on the chains and the hitch was still locked closed. So it had never been on the vehicle at all. Luckily, they had driven all the way through town past lots and lots of people on the side of the road that were leaving the Camp Oven Festival, got all the way out to this straight road and then the caravan just unhooked itself and slipped off to the side. Could have been a lot of people killed, trucks, buses, cars come the other way, but we were all very lucky because it just simply drifted off to the side and the brakes had come on, which was great. The car in front of us was directly behind the van when it happened. They pulled up, jumped out to give them a hand and hook all back up. They did a great job, so good on you guys for helping out. Once the van was all hooked back up properly, 
the owner was safely on his way with the van with virtually no damage at all and no injuries. How lucky. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. If you want a reminder, hit the bell and remember, we always love a thumbs up. If you'd like to be more involved, check out our Patreon page or our website.